Hi guys, it's reaction time. We got the band Wigwam and the song High and Dry. Don't think it's the uh, Def Leppard song, I don't believe. Um, so really excited about hearing this. I love Wigwam, I love Wigwam. They're a lot of fun, they sound great. They're fucking great musicians. They bought our great album two years ago, because we were in the new year, remember? So um, love Never Say Die album. They got an album coming out called Out of the Dark. The title track came out a couple of weeks ago. That was great. Let's listen to High and Dry. Um, just quickly run through the band members. Quickly, you've got Arj Sten Nielsen on vocals. You've got Teeny on guitars, who's Trond Holter. They've got these like, um, so Glam is Arj Sten Nielsen. They've got these like uh, names, these comical names. Teeny is Trond Holter on guitars. Flash is Bernd Janssen on the bass and Sporty is Oyston Anderson on the drums. Makes it easier for me. I might just use the um, the, the comical names from now on, but uh, very cool indeed. Um, I don't know if that's, their names have just come up. That's the first time I've seen them names they used for this band. I don't know if it's just because of this video. I don't know, but it is an official lyric video, this one. So here we go with Wigwam and High and Dry. Saturday night, hi! No, it ain't gonna be that one. Here we go, here we go. You left me cold, but baby, now you're back For a piece of the party <laughs> Like a kitty cat But your claws are the shop to be charming You were the one to be you got Give it a stop there, guys. Halfway through, always do. Love it, love it, love it. A bit bluesy, this one. It's a bit weird, you know, because I'm not a huge bluesy fan when it comes to heavy rock. Um, but Wigwam, it's saint about them. They did a brilliant song, Hard Love, I think it was called, on Never Say Die. It was one of my favorite songs, and it was so heavy. It was so bluesy, but dirty, bluesy, heavy stuff. I mean, early 80s White Snake, the band would have been proud to have written that one. Absolutely amazing song. Check that out if you haven't heard that one. But this is along the same lines. Those thumping rhythms, a bit bluesy, like I said. It's really fun, this song. I mean, I'm trying to look at lyrics. I don't know if you've seen the last few videos I've done where I'm looking at lyrics more, trying to decipher what they are. And I'm not very good at that stuff. So I've, I've made a commitment. It's not new, a New Year's resolution because that's too much of a commitment to me. <laughs> to look at lyrics more and try and work out. But it's hard. It is hard because the, f the first thing I focus on, I always have done, is the music. Musically, this is very cool indeed. It's very heavy. Um, bluesy heavy, obviously. Very catchy. That chorus is very catchy. They're such a melodic band. Every song they write, you know, you can hum along to within seconds. They're a very catchy band indeed. Um, 
But lyrically, it's very straightforward. I like that. <laughs> it's easy for me. It's almost like, obviously, a relationship. A woman leaves him, you know, breaks his heart, then wants to come back, but he sounds like he was having fun, and he thinks, you know, fuck you, I'm not interested. Um, that's what it sounds like to me. Uh... Very, I like the straightforward lyrics sometimes, <laughs> especially if I'm trying to concentrate on music and lyrics at the same time. But I love this man. Um, I think this is a, I think their best music, Wigwam. I mean, a couple of their albums are great early on in their career, but I think these last couple of albums have been spot on. They really have, and they sound great. Then they sound heavy, they sound really, I mean, the, the production is absolutely smashes it out of the park. It sounds great, it really sounds brilliant. Um, really bass heavy but the guitars are not you know are up front as well it's hard to get that balance and they seem to have got that perfectly uh, drums sound massive and of course Arge Sten Nielsen glam's vocals sound brilliant here we go for the rest guys because Tron Holt is going to do a solo hopefully and I can give you a little bit of a um, my thoughts into the solo because he's a brilliant guitarist here we go Absolutely brilliant. Trond held, holding back a little bit there on the guitars, I think. But I mean, man, he is fast becoming one of my favourite guitarists, modern guitarists, if you like. Although they've been going a few years now, I do love his guitar playing. It's got a real crunch to it. Um, but he's a brilliant solo soloist as well. He can play some brilliant anything. He can play anything, but he's holding back a little bit there more, thinking about the tune, which is even more important. You know, don't go off because you can play the guitar at 100 mile an hour and just play your own thing. He plays within the song and that's one of the qualities that Trond Holter has got. It was catchy. It was bluesy. It was fun. Love Wigwam. Let me know what you think in the comments below, guys. And I'll see you soon.